Users of Data Studio can now bring in optimizer data into their existing reports or make entirely new reports. The instructions for making it work are right here. You can, of course, delete those after you've gone through them. One thing you'll have to take a closer look at is the specific API that you'll need to connect to. But let me show you how this is done. So let's remember optimization suggestions and then go ahead and start with step number one, which is to duplicate this report into my own account. Now, I have to pick my own data source because, of course, I want to see my optimizer data and not just the optimizer data in this sample report. So to do this, we go into the community connectors. Under the community connectors, you can search for it or you can just scroll and you'll find the optimizer data connector right here. So let's go ahead and select this one for use. Now, we have to make sure that we are authorized. So first of all, we need to do an authorization through our Google account to access the service. So just log into your Google account, give it permission, and that's going to be step number one of getting the connection established. Now, step number two is to connect to your optimizer account. I'm already logged into my optimizer account, so it simply shows me this page. Otherwise, it would ask you to log in. And of course, if you don't have an account with optimizer, you can always sign up for a two week free trial. So let's go ahead and allow this to make the connection. Now we're done and we can close this window. And this is going to re-render, and now we get to pick from the data service. And this is the thing I asked you to remember from the first page. We have a couple of API services at Optimizer. The one that we care about for this report is called Optimization Suggestions. So we choose that one. We click Connect. This is going to make the connection, and it's going to show us the data that's now being brought into Data Studio. On this page, we don't have to do anything other than say, add it to the report. Now we've switched over our data sources and we're ready to hit the button to create the new report using our own optimizer data. Here we have the copy that's being made. And at this point, we can do edits and we can change this around as we see fit. So for example, it would be very easy to delete this piece of default text. Now, if you wanted to bring some of this data into your existing Data Studio reports, that's also really easy. All you have to do is grab the data and the visualization you want copy it and paste it over into the other report. Google will handle the details of bringing over not just the visualization, but also the data connection. So it's very simple to move these widgets between the different reports that you may already have.